So people so ask me questions. What questions do you have to ask me? I'll be asking you them. How many animals have you saved since you've gone vegan? A hundred. From not eating them? I don't know. Hey guys, it's Liv, and today I'm here with my boyfriend, Pav, and on one of my Instagram pictures, I asked you to ask us questions to answer in this video, so that's what we're going to do today. Okay, from Veg Trisha. When did you guys meet, and how did you guys know that you were the one for each other? So we met four years ago. Five, Five days, days ago, ago, we had our four-year anniversary. So we met four years ago on January 18th. <laughs> well, we didn't meet then. That was our first date. And how did you know that you were the one for each other? <laughs> um, I don't know. I knew that you were the one for me because you were different than all the other guys that I had been with. And you you were more like mature about it and you didn't want to like play games or be stupid. You just wanted to be with me and then that's how I knew that you were the one for me. And a lot of other stuff, but mainly that at the beginning. How did you know that I was the one for you? <laughs> so many reasons. <laughs> <laughs> Where do I begin? Oh. All right, next question. <laughs> okay, just another high carb vegan asks, what is your idea of a perfect date and what are your favorite and least favorite foods? My idea of the perfect date is the one we had the other day where we went to a vegan restaurant and we tried the new menu and then maybe if we did something like fun, <laughs> like if we painted, <laughs> or if we, I don't know, like we went like to salsa club or like did something active and fun, like salsa some random club. thing, yeah. But my idea of a perfect date includes a vegan restaurant. Well, What's yours? Okay, work? I hate pickles. Um, yeah, least favorite foods would be like besides like Ooh, animal products. Almost anything my grandma makes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she anything learned to like, cook in like a really hard time during the wars, where there was like really limited resources. <laughs> so so there like cabbage there was a lot of cabbage and potatoes and like just like the worst things. But we like potatoes, not her potatoes. It's hard to ruin potatoes. She finds a way. <laughs> What's your favorite food? Mine's smoothies and stir fry and potatoes. And pasta. I think my favorite food is sushi. Sushi. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Sweet potato. Sweet potato sushi. Five questions on Tumblr. Question one. How do I find a boyfriend? I guess I should answer that. No, let me handle it. How do you find a boyfriend? Well, it's easy. Oh, I don't think you find... Why? It's so easy. How is it easy? You just go talk to a guy. I don't, know. I don't think it's that easy for a lot of people. Why not? I don't know, because people are <laughs> nervous to talk to guys. So? Yeah, I agree. I think, like, you can't put anyone... Like, let's say you have a crush on someone. You can't, like, put anyone on a pedestal and be like, Wow, like, they're so much cooler than me. I can't talk to them. <clears throat> you have to just be like, He's a dumb guy, just like all the other dumb guys. <laughs> and then you can just talk to them. But, I don't know, you can't really just find a boyfriend, like, you want to just, I don't know, talk to people and make friends and then maybe that will turn into something, but you shouldn't just go looking for a boyfriend. Or should you? I don't know, if you want. Well, just don't, like, go out hoping to, like, meet someone that will be a boyfriend. Like, I wasn't looking for anything when I found you. That's a good point. You weren't looking for some. well, maybe you were. What do you find attractive about each other? I love your butt. Oh my god. What else? This. This. <laughs> Award winning. I find your eyes attractive. You like them? Yeah. I think they're too blue. Okay, so that's never been said in the history of life. And I like your smile. Smile for the camera. Aww. Okay. Is your boyfriend vegan? If not, does he want to be? Am I vegan? No. I'm like, uh, I'm pretty much vegan when I'm with you. Do I want to be? I think so. Definitely. So I'm slowly being molded into it. Yes. I might just completely jump ship. 
Advice for how to tell if a guy likes you. This is you again. Tell if a guy likes you. Yeah. I don't know. It's really hard to answer because like I, I think, only know from like my experiences. Like I don't. I think you. If a guy likes you, you'll know it. If they're acting like they don't really like you, they're not playing games. They just probably don't like you. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> much. If he didn't like you, he'd just be like, Cute be always putting you off, like stuff yeah. like that. But if he's actually giving you the time of day, there's like little cues which you'll like what you should catch on to. I don't know. Okay, I think if he doesn't cancel plans or like always like be moving your plans, yeah, like well, if you can't yeah. hang out, you'll like make plans for the next time when you can. It's not like oh I can't today and then you don't remake the plans. Like, okay, what was your first date like? This one should be easy. You just have to describe what our first date was like. I don't know. Okay, super were, cold. I kind of wanted to go do something inside. Yes, I did. Didn't bring a jacket. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, so it was like a freezing, freezing, freezing cold day in the dead of winter. Like, I see you from the distance, and I'm like, oh, like, trying not to look like I know it's you. So I was just on my phone, and then I just see this figure come up, and he's wearing a sweatshirt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like bundled up in five layers with long johns under my jeans, and you come up wearing a sweatshirt <laughs> and no gloves. <laughs> and you were late. Was I? Yeah. I should have known then that. That was gonna be the start of your lateness forever. What did you think when you first saw me standing there? I was kind of shy. You were? Yeah. Aww. I thought I was shy. Just we talked like once in person. Talked a lot on Facebook. Then met up like two then weeks you later. Said, hey, you wanna do something? Like go to a party? And I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust that. And then uh, after that, we walked to Starbucks. Starbucks. Yep. And I got you. So you didn't buy it for me. No? No. You didn't buy me. My oh, yeah, I remember that. Because we both went in, and you were in front of me. And you just kind of went up by yourself, and I was like, I didn't know what to do because I wasn't used to like the first like real date. And I was like, so do I just like slide up behind her and like <laughs> whip out my wallet? <laughs> or do I just like let her do it? Let her, let her do her you own thing? You let her and... do my own thing. And I was like, wow, I'm oh, I didn't wanna... for my own drink. Was... And then we sat at a table and talked for a long time. Yeah. Oh, I'm like the f worst date guy ever. Oh, yeah. So that's all our question. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for interviewing, for letting me interview you. And... Anybody has any more requests for videos with this guy? I'm thinking we could do like cooking videos together. Like like a competition, like we both have to make something and see who makes it better. Cause that channel cooking that videos? I watch, Hot For Food does it, where they like have a challenge, so like they each have to make like a burger and then like they see who wins and people vote in the comments. But you're gonna like, win. But like you might do something really interesting, I don't know. I don't even know these people. So don't forget to subscribe to her channel. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. No, to my <laughs> channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave a thumbs up if you think that he's hot. What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Leave a thumbs up if you want to see him shirtless. That's objective. Let's <laughs> <laughs> get all my apples in one basket. <laughs> <laughs>